right guys, Chris Vermeulen here. I want to quickly run through our remote control, the progress that we've had and what we're doing uh, with some improvements on it. So let's just take a look at the remote and we'll show you a little bit in action. So more or less we've got the remote here that uh, obviously you've probably seen a photo of that we've posted on our website and, uh, and an update out here. But um, more or less we've updated the grip. Now the grip is already really comfortable. It's really comfortable in the right hand. We wanted to make it more comfortable in the left hand. Obviously there are still quite a few left handers out there, but the majority are right handed. So we wanted to make it fit really comfortable with both lefties and righties. So we've redesigned the grip in this area and up in this area and it really fills the handle out, makes it really comfortable for left-handed uh, users as well. Now, one other thing we have done is we've extended the front a little bit further and um, we've made it so that this trigger now is a double trigger. So we have technically, we now have reverse on the units, which you can turn on and off that feature. I know if you're using a reduction gear and you're, you're not careful and you're going forward really fast and if you hit reverse, you could very easily just strip uh, strip your shafts or your uh, your reduction gear uh, very easily. So depending on your design, you may or may not use the reverse or want to use the reverse, but it's on there. And the reverse also makes this thing work really well with electric skateboards. Now there's, you know, this is a waterproof remote control that you can take out with electric skateboard in the rain, home from work, to work, doesn't matter the weather, you don't have to worry about it again, it's soggy and, uh, and, and shorting out. Uh, in your hand so and it's also very impact resistant you can you can pretty much uh, um, beat this thing up pretty well and uh, you don't have to worry about it uh, breaking on you uh, so uh, just showing you the way the throttle works we've, we've designed the the trigger to have uh, really nice throttle control most of the control is further in on the trigger where you've got lots of lots of control over your finger versus having a finger floating way out here and trying to feather a very sensitive trigger we've got most of the control set back down in this groove here uh, that it's very close to your hand really easy to move you're just the end of your finger and fine-tune adjustment to, uh, as you go uh, i know uh, depending on the type of motor setup you have i know there's a lot of setups that have extremely sensitive throttle and if you're using a bigger prop and um, and you've got a sensitive throttle when you give it throttle it jolts the board forward faster when you let off the throttle too much the, the it almost acts as brakes the larger prop so you can send you over the front. So what we've done is made it very, very smooth with the control in a comfortable zone that is uh, close to a full squeeze grip when you're riding. So we put some tape on the on the motor here and uh, pretty straightforward. The, the throttle control here, you've got... Really easy throttle fret feathering and uh, again the updated rem remote has got reverse but uh, we're going to be testing out that and a bunch of these props we've got some steel versions of these props coming uh metal ones to uh, to test are getting 3d printed and uh, we're going to do a whack of testing coming forward and i'm going to roll out hopefully this spring with uh, a model or two that is ready to rock and roll along with the remote control uh, part of the updated uh, design we're doing in the remote itself is just to lower some injection molding costs as well. Obviously, uh, injection molding is not cheap, so we have to do a, a bulk order for these. But more or less, we've designed it to uh, be white label as well. We can put any nice bubble logo, uh, any type on there to go forward. So whether you're buying a V-foil, hydrofoil, uh, electric propulsion system, um, you get the remote. Or if you're building your own, you can buy the standard remote. And of course, if you've got your own uh, device you want to uh, control, you can throw your label on it and uh, we can put your label on it for you. Anyways, take care. Talk to you in a bit.